Hello everybody and welcome to the video. Today we're going to be taking a look at Xiao Chun, the Fire Drunken Master. Now if you guys don't know this, I am in love with the Drunken Master family. It is one of my favorite three star families out there. Huan being, in my opinion, a really good unit. But um, of course we're not looking at Huan today. We're looking at Xiao Chun. Um, the way I built him, I think, is going to be pretty basic. But I think you guys will understand it after we look at the skills. So... Obviously, um, we're going to look at the skills. We'll probably look at the skill preview and then maybe how some people built theirs. And then we'll take a look at mine and then we'll use them in a couple places. So, uh, first things first. First skill, rolling punch. Throws a punch that ignores the enemy's defense and weakens the attack power for one turn with an 80% chance. This skill one is really good. I mean, with Juan, like, for example, Juan, um, he's on, like, a support build. He's, like, he's built like my Fraun is, right? Speed... HP and attack because he's more of a support unit. His first skill can easily deal 10k, right? Built on support. So imagine if you built this guy on damage, how much that first skill will do. It'll do a lot. Plus, weakens attack power for one turn. Really useful. Um, second skill, drunken kick. Kicks the enemy unsteadily. Gets drunk and attacks a random enemy with rolling punch with a 30% chance afterwards every three turns when fully skilled up. So he will use this skill, which is just a base. It, it's a multi-hit, if I recall. And then he does have a 30% chance to go into his skill one. His third skill, um, Tiger Punch, attacks the enemy two times and increases the attack power of all allies for two turns. Gets drunk and attacks the random enemy with rolling punch. With a 50% chance afterwards every three turns. So you're using these quite often. And I do notice that they come up quite often. But you'll notice that all, like the only real real utility or whatever he has is like attack power increasing. And then maybe like attack breaking. But everything else is just damage, right? He ignores enemies defense here. And then he does tons of hits here with a chance to go into his first skill. So I built him on some damage. But I want to see how... Other people built him. Um, statistics. Fatal Blade. Yeah. Rage Blade. I was thinking maybe Violent or Revenge or something like that. Maybe. But Attack. Crit Damage. Some people put Speed, which I don't blame them. Like some people might want to get that skill 3 off. But I, I, I want to bring him just because of his Attack buff. But Crit Damage. Yep. Attack. Okay. So pretty obvious how he was going to be built. Usage, Siege Battle, but that's, he's only used if it's like 3 star only accounts really. I mean, you see him, okay, never mind. Some people are actually genuinely using him. <laughs> Interesting. Rift, Rift Raid, wow. Huh. Frontline unit, I, I'm, maybe they built him more tanky, but Dimensional Hole, okay. Rift Dungeon. Okay. I think we've seen enough. Uh, let's look at a skill preview just to kind of get a look at his skills. And then we'll finally go into the build and mess with him. Okay, so skill one. Obviously, this is going to be basic. Roll and punch. Skill two. So, wait. Boom, boom. So, it's like... It looked like it was two hits. Boom, boom. Or three hits. And then he did have the chance. It's either two or three hits. It sounds like three. But then you get this skill. One, two. And then attack increase and then the chance to do that. Pretty basic. But um, let's take a look. So here's how mine is. It's not perfect at all. I mean, 86% crit rate. 172 crit damage. 1800 or 1,825 bonus attack. His attack stat is not that bad. Um, but let's look at the runes. Obviously, he's Fatal Blade. I've tried to just roll the runes, like, uh, or, or use some enchantments to get them looking okay. I mean, he doesn't need speed on that one. That could easily be flat attack, and that's better in my opinion. Is that the highest? Oh god, I didn't check. Yeah, that or defense percent would have been better, but... These are his runes. <laughs> and I just gave him random uh, artifacts. This is obviously the 3 star count, as you can see. <laughs> as you can see. But, um, 
we're going to take him into a couple places. Um, first place I want to bring him is Windbeast, obviously. I mean, he has a potential for tons of damage. So, let's take him there. Okay, so I swapped him out for Nangrim. So, uh, this is the three-star team that I use. very consistent. This is Nangrim. Um, ignores all damage reduction effects, so it just does pretty decent hit. And then this one does damage based off of... Uh, or no, it doesn't do damage based off of HP. Inflicts damage that ignores the target's defense with 20% for every attack. With a 20% chance with every attack. So, ignores defense dependent. And then the chance increases depending on harmful effects up to 50%. So, he has a chance to ignore defense. But, I imagine Xiao Chun is going to have it done more often. I hope I haven't been calling him Huan. Anyways, maybe we get a higher score. Maybe we don't. But, um... He does ignore defense more often. It's just that he's only doing on a skill one. But he could proc many attacks. So, who knows? Let's see. Oh my gosh. How much was that? Did he just... It was, I saw at least two 26Ks. So, easily oh, about 52,000, 53,000. Depending... He's not doing that bad. Oh my god, 152 skill 1. But re what really matters is like this area. I don't care how much he's doing when the boss is down. I want to see how much he's doing like that. Like, that was triple 9k, I think. So he's doing pretty decent damage. I mean... Compared to everybody else, he's getting that out consistently, too. That wasn't that bad. That is that a higher score? That's not a higher score. No, that's way less. Wow, that's far less. But he, it's not bad. I mean, what do I expect? <laughs> this team's good. Oh, no. See, I don't even use this team. So, hmm. Let's try him... Let's try him on the Light Beast. So again, we're taking out Nangrim, the, the, the Fire Beast Hunter, and putting in Xiao Chun. I want to I see, because that first skill can do really big damage. I mean, the ignore defense can be really big. So I want to see how he performs here. Who knows, maybe he's better. Maybe he shreds the shields. Okay, that wasn't that bad, actually. It wasn't crazy, but that was his skill one. And then he might pop in with the, his skill two or skill three. Oh my gosh. See, it's like he's kind of killing it. He's not bad. He, he What he is, is he's basic. I mean, he he's really given one job, and that's the job he's going to perform. But, oh my gosh. He's not doing that bad. Was that? Oh my! Oh my gosh! He's actually proking a lot. I guarantee you, he doesn't do this off video. We might have to use him like an arena. I mean, I'm gonna lose an arena, but hey, so be it. Let's see. Okay, so when it comes to shields, he's not exactly destroying them, but that's because he's doing multi hits. The more hits you deliver, the less um, the shield goes down. 22k for skill 1. I saw that one. And everybody else is like they're not even delivering anything close unless they're using their like their big damaging skill. So his skill 1 doing 22k, it's pretty freaking good. He got close. Okay. What we're going to do um we could try taking him ah uh, Let's see if we could take him into a spiritual realm, maybe. I don't know. Let's just try it. Let's, let's, let's cut the spiritual realm. Okay, so <laughs> just a little bit of hind, uh, of uh, context. I'm still spir uh, experimenting with spiritual realm for the three-star account. So this team either wins or they lose. But just to give you some idea of who's on the team and what they do, Lala on friends, he's on some crit build weird BS. He's on there, but um, I think this team is pretty basic. 
you need tons of buffs to enhance your crit rate so you can do damage. That's what we're going to be doing. I'm just hoping he can get in massive damage. Okay, we got the buff. Nice, okay. Oh my god, he almost took it out completely. <laughs> 23k for a skill 1 is not bad at all. And it ignores defense, so it doesn't necessarily matter if you're moving too, you know, higher up on the floors. Because I know the defense increases on some of these monsters. But it's like he's going to ignore defense. He just has to deal with a little bit more of a HP pool. Gosh. Skill 1 is crazy. He is just... <laughs> You're just trying to impress people in this video. You want people to build you. <laughs> what are you attacking them for? What do you attack the tower for? Oh my gosh. Mm. Oh, you're getting targeted. Lala, Snoo Snoo, I, I don't know what you're called, but you need to cleanse, <laughs> please. Oh, we're doing no damage because of the attack break. Boom, 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 boom. Now we're healed. And we're right back to where we started. 23k. Okay. Not bad. Um, That wasn't that bad. Okay. Wasn't that bad. Plus, you guys got a little sneak peek at what I was messing with in the teams. But there's some work that needs to be done there. And I feel like... uh. We do need healing, but I don't know if Lala is doing a good job. I believe that's his name. Let's just let's just go into the arena. Let's go into the arena. Let's see what we could do, and uh, that's what we'll call it. Okay, so we're here in the arena. We 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 might win this. We might. Um, it depends if we can outspeed. Hopefully, my Bernard is fast enough. Let's see. Uh, he he might outspeed. Plus, Megan will give us. An attack bar boost. We have two different attack bar boosts. I just want to get the immunity off before anything. But uh, let's let's hope. I mean, they got a pretty basic team on here. Oh, we outspeed. Okay. So we're definitely going to get to take someone out real quick. Um, I think Lucian is a priority. For sure. We could do this. Oh my gosh. That Lucian is pretty fast. Not, not going to lie. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> How much was that? Like, almost like thirty-one thousand, thirty-two thousand ish. Um, gosh, I don't know. Just do this randomly and take out the brownie magician, maybe. Let's see. Can skill two just wipe Sierra? I'm I'm curious. Maybe I should do this. Oh wow, he he actually didn't do that bad. I want to make sure we keep immunity. That bomb did nothing. They have their Sierra on like attack HP HP or something. Okay. Xiao Chun, we need you to save the freaking day. Boom. I don't know how much that damage that was. Oh my god, I thought she was going to proc into her thing. Well, Lulu's dying, but that's fine. Because we win this no matter what. And, oh my gosh, that's disgusting. I know we had defense break, but god dang it. Um, let's do another battle. Let's do another battle. I'm feeling pretty good. We lose, okay, we lose this. <laughs> we lose this, but it'd be fun. Why, why your defense break? Stop, 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 stop. Okay, okay, okay. I understand! Oh, is it my turn now? <laughs> okay. <laughs> There's no way we win this. Whatever. We, we, we fight this, and if I lose, I lose. Whatever. And then we leave. <laughs> Gosh, man. Everyone with this freaking unit. It's just like you focus all of your runes on this... It's like you, like, f focus on someone else. Your Fraun still has 600 attack power. Focus on her. 
Oh my gosh. Your units aren't built. This is your only built freaking unit. <laughs> I'm so salty right now. You don't even believe it. Yeah. Yeah. And we come. Oh. I thought we were coming back. Boom. Just hope we don't get no bomb from Sierra. Why y'all aiming for him? <laughs> get off his D, man. <laughs> oh my God. I just want to win. <laughs> okay. We get you. Oh! Oh! Oh my God. I, if we lose, we lose. I am more than proud of that. That was good. You saw how much he took out of her health? If you would just be better than I am at the game and like build your teams properly and all that, easy. That would be that would have been the easy fight using him. Oh my gosh. Okay, despite my terrible performance in the arena, I I'm leaving those lost fights in. I mean, I lost some fights. I'm just not good at the game, right? But <laughs> clearly. But you saw how much damage he was doing. <laughs> he was owning people. And it's like, here's the thing. Sorry about that. Here's the thing. It's all of them. All of them have that skill one ignore defense. So it's like you build one. Uh, I mean him specifically. But if you build one of these units on that. Oh my gosh. Skill one he took almost took that... Oracle out. Oh my gosh. What is her freaking name? I can't remember. I feel like it's not Bastet. It, it's something along that line. Along those lines. Praha. Am I even close? Am I, am I even in the right family? No. Bastet is... Yeah. Okay. Whatever. They're, they look alike. Kind of. Uh, not really. But um... Obviously this guy is a fun build. Yeah, I'm not going to say he's a must build. There are a lot of units... That have skill one uh, attack or, or ignore defense. I believe uh, it, this guy specifically, the Frederick. No, he ignores all damage reduction effects. There's a difference. Okay, there, there's a difference between ignore all damage reduction effects and then just straight up ignoring defense. <laughs> no, damage ignore defense. I mean... Skill 1, too. Here's the thing. The reason I, I think he is much better than a lot of, like, those units that do ignore defense is because his skills proc into the skill 1. So he just does one of these two randomly. And then you proc into this. And this thing, you guys have seen it, has done anywhere from 15 to 23, sometimes 30,000. It does a lot of damage. <laughs> I mean, maybe not, like, maybe in Arena. You could probably use him in Arena. But I think he has some use, and who knows, maybe he gets a 2A in the future, and then he just becomes insane. But until that day comes, um, I don't know. I'd say he's worth building. Fatal Blade, Rage Blade, Violent Blade, Violent Revenge, one of those four could work on him in some way, shape, or form. Maybe you build him defensively, but yeah, I don't know. You guys tell me what you think in the comments, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.